Hey my lovely viewers, what do you do with your empty acrylic color bottles? Do you discard them? I'm going to show you an amazing DIY today after which I'm sure you will save and repurpose these cute bottles. Yes, today I'm going to show you how to make this beautiful pillar candle holder using empty acrylic color bottles. Isn't it looking amazing? I'm also going to show you a glass bottle decor and this one is also an easy one in which you can repurpose your glass bottles which are always lying around our homes. So without any further ado, let's quickly start today's video. Starting with the pillar candle holder, you need to apply a strong glue on the rim of the bottle and stick the other bottle onto it. Now except for the first bottle, I have kept the other bottles upside down. That is the second, third and fourth bottle. Repeating the process for all of them. Now let it dry completely and once it is dried, we will apply the base coat. And once the base coat is done, again let it dry completely. Meanwhile, we will get the top section ready where the candle will sit and for that I am using a coconut shell. And now we will also use a base coat for the shell. Once everything has dried, we will stick the coconut shell at the top. Let it sit nicely, hold it for a few seconds so that it takes its position. Now this is completely dried and we will move on to the final coat. For this I am taking a Fevicryl Flesh Tint and this is a beautiful colour. You can use any colour of your choice but this colour looks amazing for this DIY. And this is the difference. The camera is not really uh, able to justify the color, but it's really, really beautiful, guys. If you're liking this video and finding it useful, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done yet, guys. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you get updates of all my latest videos whenever I upload one. And if you have already subscribed, thank you so much for your love and support, my friends. This is the beautiful shade guys, I really like this and let me know how you liked it. Now it is completely dried and this is the final step. I am taking a golden dust. This is again from Fevicryl. I am taking it on my finger and rubbing it on the bottle. You don't need to cover it completely with the golden color. You just need to apply it here and there and it gives a nice beautiful vintage look. Don't forget the top section. Now whatever residue is left on my finger, I will just rub it here and there on the body of the bottle. And that's it. This looks so beautiful guys. I just love it. This DIY is really easy, you just need time for drying part, that is the drying of glue and the colors. I'm so happy with the outcome, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below guys. If you plan to recreate this, do tag me guys, my social media links are in the description box below. Alright, let's move on to the second DIY for this video and for this we need a glass bottle. And this is a Fevicryl 3D outliner. You get this very easily in the stationery. With the help of this outliner, draw any pattern of your choice. Today, I'm going to draw leaves. This outliner will help the glass color which is coming up next to stay in place as it creates a boundary for the glass color and it remains within the boundary. So I'm drawing leaves on the entire body of the bottle. This outliner helps us to keep the glass color in place within the boundaries. You should not have any gaps while you are drawing the outline. And now this is the glass color I'm using and filling the leaves with the colors. Now 
These glass colors are also easily available in the stationery shops. Adding some more detailing once the glass color dried. And here is the completed look guys. Look at it how quick and beautiful this DIY is. I have also done another glass color DIY and you guys showered so much love. Thank you so much guys. And here comes both our DIY for today's video in one screen. Thank you so much for watching guys. Please hit the like button if you like this video. I will see you soon with more ideas. Take care of yourselves and stay safe. Bye.